Alrighty, so I am going to check out some trailers right now. I thought about doing um, a review, but I don't have all my pictures gathered together, and it's a little late, and I don't really want to get into a review right now, because when I do that, I do tend to go on and on and on, and so I don't want to do that right now. Maybe tomorrow. Anyway, the first trailer that I'm going to check out right now is for something on Netflix, and it's actually been out for a few months. I think this trailer was dated October something. It's for something called Mortal, M-O-R-T-E-L. Yeah. But there, I have another one in my, in my list that's called Mortal, M-O-R-T-A-L. And at first I thought they were the same, but then I, I checked out like the very, very beginning when it was playing on the, the two different, I think the, I don't think the other one is a Netflix. Anyway, whatever. I checked it out and it looks like they're two separate things. So I'm going to check out at least one of them right now. I don't remember what it said this one was about. Maybe some type of fantasy. I, I don't know. So let's just go ahead and press play right now or I'll press play anyway. Il y a quelque chose dans l'air. Okay, so. Quelque chose de mauvais qui approche. Désobéissant. Fourbe. Je t'ai vu coller des affiches pour retrouver ton frère. Je peux t'aider Attends, attends, attends. Tu crois que si j'avais besoin d'aide, je viendrais voir un clochard comme toi Oh, it's a series. Je okay. Je peux te donner That's des pouvoirs pour looking. retrouver ton frère. Mais vous devez être deux. Victor Non Salut. Mais j'ai besoin de toi, Victor. Faut que tu restes loin de tout ça, Sophie. J'ai Chikaza, mon Tu peux pas lui faire confiance. T'es à toi, je te fais confiance. Ah 53,20€. Non. Quoi Pour nous, c'est gratuit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mon frère, il n'y a rien que je fais pas. Rien. C'est toi, c'est les pouvoirs. C'est comme une drogue. C'est toxique, Sofiane. On peut manipuler genre euh, un dieu. Obé se laissera pas faire. Vous hein. emportez avec moi Okay, so this has been out for a bit. I could not tell what that language was. At first I thought it was French, and then I was not so sure. And this this god or this entity or whatever, obey, whatever it's called, um, I'm not sure what culture that god comes from. I mean, I'm assuming it's actually based on a real, you know, mythological god from wherever this takes place. So... Um, Okay, where was I? I was saying something about, I'm not sure what culture this god is from. Don't know anything about him. Um, this show, it, it, it sort of a little bit reminds me of Ragnarok. The, uh, the Norwegian show that I did a reaction and review to, uh, I don't know, a few months ago, a couple few months ago, and I did end up watching that. That was one of the things that I wanted to do a, a review of. Um, I watched that when I was in Cali, and um, it, it kind of reminds me of that in that it's about these two, well, it's focused on these teenagers. Um, one of them called the other this brother, but I don't know if he meant like if they really are brothers or if he just meant like symbolically, but, uh, you know, these two teenage guys and they get taken up with this with this entity this godlike power whatever it is i wasn't what's going on in the other room um 
I wasn't super thrilled about this trailer. I mean, I think I like the Ragnarok trailer better and maybe it's just because I'm more familiar with the mythology and I'm not super familiar with, with Norse mythology. I just have a passing understanding of it, but I know nothing about this. And so it wasn't, it didn't really grab me. Uh, maybe it was also just the trailer, the, the way it was, uh, the way it was filmed. It wasn't that long. I mean, it, to this point, it's only a minute 40. It felt like it was longer than that, though, and uh, I'm I'm not sure if that's just because I wasn't um, I wasn't really I wasn't really drawn to the material as much as like let's say I was with Ragnarok, um, just because you know I don't know anything about this. It may, and the stories, you know, I'm comparing these two, but they are two different things. I mean, it, the story looks like it is definitely going to take a different turn in Ragnarok. Uh, the characters uh, behave differently, and it looks like one of the at least one of the characters in here is being negatively influenced by this entity, this god or whatever, and he's going to uh, take those powers and he's going to abuse them. So, you know, it, it, it diverges, but the it just the reason I'm drawing those parallels is because it just the the basic um, element. What was I saying? I keep getting interrupted. Uh, oh, I was saying that the basic sort of, um, not necessarily the full premise, but the basic sort of like outline is, is similar. Um, teenage guys, uh, especially one of them is the focus and, uh, being somehow influenced by or connected with, uh, a God, something like that. So, but yeah, they, they are definitely two different things. This one, um, is, it, it's not like I've already said, it's not really pulling me like, like, uh, Ragnarok was. So I'm not sure if I will check this out or not. I'm not going to definitely say no, but in, I know that it's available and it's there if I want to check it out. I'm kind of curious to find out a little bit more about it and this, um, you know, what, what's like, if there really is, if this obey or how, if I'm even saying it right, if that is really an actual uh, mythological character or something. Um, and also to find out where does this story take place. So I can just do that anytime. I can find that at any time. So, okay, well, that was a short one, sort of, kind of. I kept getting interrupted. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this up and um, see you later. Bye. Bye.